You can't go far in Lincoln without seeing the damage left over from this week's storm. The most visible reminder, countless broken branches and uprooted trees lining streets and neighborhoods across the city. This means a busy time for those in the tree business who say repairing all the damage from the recent storm could be a lengthy effort. 1011 Sam Cobb followed the crew on the job earlier today and joins us in the studio with more. Sam. Today I spoke with a tree service company who says it could be a month or even two before the citywide mess of tree damage is cleaned up enough that evidence of the storm is no longer visible. And it could be over a year before all of the damaged trees are able to be addressed. With that amount of work, the rare occasion of working on Saturday was a no-brainer for those with the Blue Ox Tree Service this morning. They were one of many tree crews working out in the heat today. We caught up with them at their second stop, breaking up a massive tree that fell onto one homeowner's roof from their backyard. They say it's one of the worst they've seen since 80 mile per hour winds whipped through the city Wednesday night. After nearly two decades in the tree business, those who have been with the company since the start tell me this kind of damage in the capital city is something they have never seen before. Tree professionals that uh, and arborists, uh, guys that have been working in this industry for over 24 years, and they haven't seen anything like this. Well, we're going to have a lot of work, that's for sure. Um, but I'm worried about, you know, what people, we got we to make sure we remove trees that are near houses or could hurt people or near power lines. Yeah. Those with Blue Ox say the volume of calls and emails requesting their services since Wednesday has been extraordinary. They estimate around 900 since the storm, but say it's likely more. Just recently, they worked a 17-hour day looking to get a head start on what will be a long citywide cleanup effort. No customers are being turned away, but those with Blue Ox say they are doing jobs in order of priority, putting those that involve major structural damage at the top of the list in order to get any displaced families back into their homes as soon as possible.